I came to New York. To do what? What you saying? To do what? I went to a national training school of the Young Communist League. Is that Pop Mandel's? Uh, no. Huh. No. This was uh, strictly uh, Young Communist League. Oh, right. Pop Mandel uh, uh, was more uh, an instructor in national education for the Communist Party. Right. See, so you knew Pop Mandel? Huh? You knew Pop Mandel? I knew of him, yeah. Uh -huh. How was he had tonight? I had uh -huh. I had talked to about because Hosey had, uh, uh -huh. had gone through that, but I've read a lot of references to him. He's sort of a legend. He's a legend. In the, in the uh, training, uh, so yeah, fine. Yeah, as a matter of fact, I was his quote unquote son, probably now. A wonderful man, but also his uh, wife. Mm -hmm. and now, what was, you went to the training school, what was, I mean, to do, to train for what? I mean, what was the training? Well, it was uh, a training school to understand uh, uh, better the foundations of uh, Marxism and Leninism. We uh, were able to uh, uh, have classes uh, and, um, in dialectical materialism, historical materialism, uh, classes and lectures in uh, political economy. Uh, we were able to uh, discuss uh, trade unionism uh, in all of its aspects. The aspect of craft unions, uh, the problems of uh, uh, organizing the unorganized in the mass production industries, which in that day had hardly begun, this aspect. Uh, we uh, studied the uh, national and colonial question, and we uh, uh, discussed the youth problem in general and relating all of these subjects to the specific problems of uh, youth, and we had to understand that uh, the youth, quite unlike the adults, uh, would have the task of uh, coming to socialism and communism in ways different than their elders. Uh, you see, it was a six-week uh, school, I believe, and the problem of study there was merely to create a hunger, to study, uh, to begin to um, uh, suggest reading and study of the classics. First of all, in the movement, but generally, and to relate uh, Marxism and Leninism to the specific problem of uh, fighting to maintain, to extend uh, democracy because only in the process of so doing would, it, would one be able to advance uh, further to the goal of socialism. This was the essence of uh, that training. And then when you finished that, you then... Oh, uh, yeah. Your... When I finished uh, that, I, uh, I became uh, head of the uh, youth section of the unemployed councils in Harlem. Uh, later, I was to become a city head of the unemployed youth council. Okay, tell me about those unemployed councils in uh, New York and in Harlem. You were involved in like the evictions, yeah. the, the rent strikes, was that? Yeah, it was many-sided. Uh, for example, uh, take the question of unemployed youth. One of the biggest problems existing at that time was the fact that uh, not only were they unemployed but uh, had no place to live. And one of our big efforts was the fight to create 
shelters for the youth. Uh, we uh, fought for the right to uh, build uh, youth centers for the unemployed in Harlem. Uh, and this was uh, part of the general fight of the whole unemployed council which took in the area that you are interested in. Uh, namely, the fight for relief uh, for the unemployed. Uh, and on that score, I think we were quite helpful, quite successful. Uh, we made better progress generally than uh, we did in terms of uh, youth shelters for the youth. 